Alright, welcome back guys to my let's play of Tex Murphy Pandora Directive where we left off. We unlocked one of the puzzle boxes that links to the other puzzle box, which I don't know how to solve that one yet. Um, we also have the um, disc that Lucia wanted. And you know what? She's not answering her phone. I'm going to try again. I, I Maybe I had to look at it. I did examine it before I ended the episode, so let's try again. Maybe, hopefully. This is Lucia Purnell. She's not at the desk. Okay, maybe I'm supposed to meet her personally. I didn't think of that. Um, let's travel to... Uh, b b b I guess San Francisco? Do I have her? No, I don't. Um, what else can I do? Hum. Hmm. I don't know what else we could do. I guess we can figure- Oh no, we can't figure out the disc, or we could. Uh, actually, I wonder if we can use it on the phone. That doesn't- No, of course not. Um, what about pickles? These drawers contain more worthless- Yeah, I don't know what to do. Um, hmm. This is a great way to start the episode. <laughs> Not knowing what to do. Huzzah. Hum. Alright guys, I am back. I went everywhere and couldn't find anything to do. Um, the only options I have really... I'm um, just gonna go to Tech's office is the anagram, but I can't do anything to Lucia. I got the disc already. The only other thing I can think of is solving that puzzle on the other puzzle box. But... I don't know what to do with that. It's gotta be... Like, I... Yeah, I don't get this puzzle. I, do I have... Okay, you know what? We're gonna do the infinite combine everything to I found, find something. Um... No! Oh. oh! Really? What? Really? What? Really? Wait, wait, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Wait. Wait, I need a... We have a map. I, I, I think we have a map. Do we have a map? Uh, da 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 da. Yeah, I have a map. Really? Really? Uh, okay. Oh! Oh! Oh, I see. Okay. Um. Okay, so I need to find a uh, clue uh, on the map. Um, I see. Wait, what? What? Okay, that's Tokyo. That's Pylong. That's Beijing. That's. Ooh, whatever. Would that be the Kathma? Uh, the Chaka... What? How does this map work? Klucha would be this one? Uh, then to Bombay? Where's Bombay? Okay, Bombay would be... Here? No. What? What? How's... It doesn't line up proper. Let's try this one. No. Okay. You know, I could I could guess. And once we get the ground like bases, no. No. Okay. Oh, I didn't think about it. Okay, wait, 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 wait. They all s it seems okay. It seems like the little red dots are the stars. Cause one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. Okay. Oh, okay. Oh, this would be this would be Bander, whatever. I think. So then these are two. And this would be. Wait. What? What? Wait. Okay, um, oh, okay, I'll just, 
this way rotating this is there no okay um I'm so confused what I don't uh, twitch <laughs> that's all I'm gonna say is twitch okay Let's see if we can figure this out. Okay, three Beijing Pore and Tokyo. Those, I swear, must be these three. But then we have a giant empty space, and that. What? Okay, where are the three points? Okay, there's three points here, here, and here. Is that that? I am so confused. Uh, I am kind of confused. I'm supposed to, yeah, I'm supposed to match the destinations with the map and everything that's gray and all, but it's not. I wonder, can I plop these on here? No, of course not. <sighs> okay, so yeah, it's. Okay, well, this looks like a handle with the little thingy. And all of them are lit up, so maybe. Um, maybe it's this, this is showing here, but, and that's the Tokyo, uh, I am, I'm, I'm kind of baffled here. Okay, you know what, I guess we'll have to... Try to find India. Or try to find India. So I tried this one. It does connect to Bombay. Bombay is a black dot. It's gonna take me a while, guys. Um, I'm going to try. My brain may be a little bit fried after this. What's with all, up all, with all the puzzles in this game? Like, seriously. This is very, like... Try up here. I did that wrong. Shit. Oh, oh my god. Seriously. Okay. Um I'm back guys. I, I had to I'm sorry, I had to I had to look at the guide to give me a start of what I need to do. Okay, this is Cal Luca right, right there. Okay. Um and then the second point they mentioned is Bombay is right there. How I I I don't I being what that gives me my basis. That that gives me my basis. Um because yeah, Kaluka, Bombay. And then we need to go to Nepal, which is like um I don't oh my god. Okay. Yeah, this was Kaluka. This was Bombay. And it's one of the red dots, so it should be this one. Should not? Okay. To Madras, which is a black dot. Okay. So this and this to to Catham, whatever. And Madras is a black dot, but it's next to Bombay. So would it be this one? <sighs> Maybe it's this one. No. Oh my god. This puzzle is going to kill me. And I don't want to resort to a guide. I really don't. But I've spent like a lot of time trying to find point A and B. <laughs> which is pretty bad. Um... Must be the start, the star point that I have wrong. Okay, let's try something else. Let's try, let's see if I try Tokyo. Um, Tokyo to Shanghai. Shanghai is... Black dot. No. I am so lost. 
Uh, oh my god. This is, this is terrible. This is the worst. Oh, oh my god. I hate, oh my god. I get a headache. I'm totally going I did that wrong. I'm gonna get a headache. Oh my Okay. This is gonna take me a while, isn't it? Okay guys, I am back yet again. So by the power of editing and <laughs> looking at a guy because I got fed up, this is how the puzzle works, cause fuck this puzzle. I don't like this puzzle. Okay, wait, one and two. Now, number three is Nepal. It is right there. Cut, whatever, it's right there. And at least number four. Where is number four? Pa, tell me, where is Madreus? Well, Madreus on the map is, like, right there. You know, right there, right? So you'd think, you know, Kathmandu would be a star point. All in Madreus. No! 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 Unless, you know, it goes like this. Wait, wrong one. Ah, pickles. This one leads to that one. How? I don't... I don't understand this puzzle I do not it's <laughs> that's all I gotta say okay so yes we got you know three and four together okay number five Cambodia which is right there right 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 you think you know it's a it's a red one right and it's three okay this one actually yeah this one I can see but not until you figure out, well, even that, oh, sorry, I'm, I just want to ramble and bitch. But no, it's actually right here. And then the Bander Day, whatever, Bander Day is right there. So technically it would be, nope. Uh, so this one here. No, I'm getting way too ahead of myself. Crap. Okay, so let's see. Number six. Oh, never mind. Number six is right here. And number seven is right there. What? No. Ugh. Even the guy looks confusing. Um. Okay, yeah. Okay, five. Okay, I missed a step. So sue me. Five and six. There we go. Five and six. And then this to this. And then that to that. I... I... <sighs> yeah. Just doing this puzzle just gave me a headache. Um, so let's see, 11 would be... Let's see, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Okay, so Bander say ba. That's all the way in the boonies. So they're saying 11 is here. Because that totally makes sense on the map. Um, to Hanoi, Vietnam. So, to right there. So, if theoretically it would go like there. No. Because <laughs> this game is supposed to be this one. Because, yeah. Uh, Tokyo, Japan, you know, I'm gonna guess is this one. To Pyongna. Uh, it's right there. So, here? No. It'll be the other store, actually. So this. And this? Okay. Okay, there we go. I figured out one without staring at the guide. Uh, <laughs> Shanghai, I'm guessing is this? And this? No. What? How? What? Yeah. <laughs> I hate this puzzle. Fuck you. <laughs> okay, let's examine this one. This box contains a module similar to the one in the first box. There's also a slide. Okay, so let's examine that. I have no idea what this thing is, though it looks like a module made to connect with other pieces. Okay, um, I guess we can combine... Um, so, oh, let's examine the slide. The slide with a picture of some strange object. Isn't that the object? If Malloy put it in the box, it must be important. Isn't that the object that was mentioned on the note? 
um, like, uh, that thing. Okay, well, let's combine. Okay, I guess I can't combine those. But I have the, um, do I not have the, z oh, I don't have the machine anymore, the one that zooms in. Okay. Now what? Maybe exit and re-enter, because I'm in my office? Let's see if that happens. Cause I saw the puzzle, it was frustratingly hard, and I don't want to do it ever, ever again. Um, hmm. What else am I supposed to do? Oh, I wonder if I have to call what's her pickle. Because I, I did, you know, get her box unlocked. Hello, Tex. Found any leads on our mystery initials? Uh, no, but I'll, you, you know what? You seem a mystic. Oh, I'm looking for help. Let's just be blunt. And I'm working on it. Called to see what information you can give me. Ask me anything you want. Okay, well... Can't help you with that. Don't know what that is. I don't know either. Okay. So that's the other thing. I need to figure out these initials. Um... I remember Fitzpatrick telling me about the... Okay, no. Um... I have no idea what this thing is, though it looks like a module made to connect with other pieces. Okay, I wonder if I combine those two together. So you won't let me. Weird, I must be missing the part. Same time, I still need to figure out what this A and E thing is. Huh. The drawing on this paper looks just like the slide I found in the puzzle box. Release code number 7AC. Where do I find that? I think I have to find the power cell. It was 7A... what was it? What's that paper? This scrap refers to some... No, not that one. Um... Yeah. The drawing on this paper looks just like the slide I found in the puzzle box. Option number number C, release code 7AC. Where... NSA, maybe? Uh, I don't know. I guess we'll try to, you know, jump everywhere. Oh, wrong button. Um... 7AC. But there was no... I don't think... No. No, why would he... No. Oh, what? Oh my god, I don't know where to go. Um... Because I need to figure out the initials. That's what I need to do, is find out the initials. Actually, I wonder if the, um... He would know. I didn't think of that. What now? I I definitely need help. Um. You know, Mac, I've been worried about your health. Have you seen those juicer machines on TV? Well, I bought one, and it really works. You probably could do with a nice cabbage and jicama blend. What'd you do? Quit the PI business and sign up with Robco? I don't want to buy a damn juicer. And I don't like wise guys coming to my office and bothering me. So ask me your questions and get out. Ooh, testy, testy. Offer from inventory. Um, can you tell me about... Oh, I don't have the stuff. Yes, ask about this one. No can do, Murphy. Shit. 
Can't help. Hmm. Well, there are. Don't know. Damn it. Okay. What am I supposed to do? All right, guys. I am back. So, you know, after trying everywhere and everything, um, I found out what you need to do. You need to make a phone call. I was on the right track before, but nope, nope, nope. I need to make a phone call. My name. Now, who do I need to make a phone call to? Gordon. Because, yeah. Yeah. Good evening, Tex. You look as though you're on to something. What can I do for you? Because we need to ask him about these people. A. E. I suppose that could refer to Archie Ellis. Ta da! Who's Archie Ellis? I believe he's the editor of the Cosmic Connection. Of course. Everything's connected to the Cosmic Connection. A. So, yeah. Uh, Cosmic Connection. I don't believe. After Fitzpatrick hangs up, I realize I forgot to ask him for Ellis's phone number. I decide to check the directory, and surprisingly, Ellis's name is listed. Okay, so Archie Ellis. Cuz, yeah. Identify yourself! Oh, oh dear. Um, Hobbit humor? I like Hobbit humor. I am Gandalf, wielder of the Glamdring and slayer of the Balrog. I am unfamiliar with your code name. Why have you contacted me? Okay, that's actually pretty, pretty great. Um, slightly askew. <clears throat> yeah, um, found this number on the wall at the Burger Barnes men's room. Are you Doris? Well, that didn't go very well. Maybe I should try it again. Yeah, let's try that again. <laughs> that was actually pretty great. Look. I don't know who you are, but I need to find out everything I can about Thomas Malloy. Tell me your name and your connection to Dr. Malloy. Uh... My name's Murphy. Dr. Malloy asked me to carry on his work involving hieroglyphics found in the Roswell spaceship. If you have knowledge of the Roswell hieroglyphics, then you should know other details regarding alien studies. If you can answer several questions, I will agree to meet with you. Uh, Who was the author of There Are Messages From Space? Uh, A? J.I. Thelwaite? Correct. <laughs> what is the name of the site of the immense alien landing strips in Peru? Uh, this one? The Plain of Nazca. Correct. Name the structure located at Tiahuana. Oh, the Gate of the Sun. The Gate of the Sun. You have passed the test. Contact Archibald Ellis at 413 Vina Del Mar. Ooh, I got chills. Okay, let's exit. I guess we travel there. Uh, no, San Francisco? Oh, Cosmic Connection. There we go. Hello. The sloppily painted sign 413 Vina Del Mar identifies the place as the Cosmic Connection. The display window is filled with charms, amulets, UFO books, and astrology charts. It doesn't look too promising. I open the door and step inside. An innocuous-looking little man is debating furiously with someone on the vid phone. extraterrestrial contact was made by the Russians throughout the 50s. It is well documented. Wrong decade, Arch. <laughs> the aliens had to get rid of Kennedy before he exposed them, and LBJ was certainly under their control, if not actually one of them. LBJ was a commie, mate. <sighs> Look, Larry, Vietnam was a ruse to divert the America's public attention and to throw our political system into chaos. Cliché, cliché, cliché. You know what, Larry? You're really beginning to get on my nerves here, okay? So why don't I call you back later? Goodbye. <laughs> you always sneak up on people like that. I'm a PI. It's what I get paid to do. Are you Ellis? Yeah, that's right. Uh, you, you must be Murphy. Uh, here's my card. <laughs> you, you got one? Uh, darn it, I... 
I think I just handed out my last one. Oh, okay. Well, you get me one later. <laughs> so, you're a private eye, huh? <laughs> Never met a private eye before. <laughs> hey, want some herbal tea? No. No? Oh, okay. <laughs> so, uh, you know Dr. Malloy? I knew him. He's dead. The NSA murdered him. Murdered him? Actually, I think the NSA wanted to take him alive. So I gather from that that the NSA wanted something from him. Now, you were with him recently. Do you have any idea what that would be? Oh, do you mind? Actually, I do. Well, I guess this is the part where you tell me everything you know about Malloy. I wasn't done with that yet. Sorry. You want me to start at the beginning? Yeah, that's pretty standard. Well, I publish a magazine called The Cosmic Connection. I'm sure you've heard of it. We feature investigative reports, uh, interviews, anything concerning uh, the supernatural, the ET, you know, anything like that. Anyway, one of my contacts in the field is a man by the name of Elijah Witt. Oh, he is a legend in the area of alien encounters. Anyway, a few months back, he set up an interview between uh, Dr. Malloy and myself. Did Witt say how he knew Malloy? No, but I think that he, uh, Witt, um, pulled some strings and got him, uh, at Malloy, a, a research lab at uh, San Francisco Tech. Uh, Witt used to be a professor there. And, uh, Any idea what uh, Malloy was doing at the research lab? I, I don't really know, um, but uh, he did use a strange term, uh, the, the Pandora device. I, I'm not really sure exactly what it means. Pandora device? Well, yeah, he talks about the, the dark seed that was unleashed. What? Well, something got loose, something alive. I mean, come on, there's been stories around for ages. Anyway, we talked about other things. You know, Roswell, of course. You know what? What you should probably do is uh, read some books, and uh, I can make some recommendations. Oh, they have big pictures. Let's see. I'm going to start you with something light. Uh, hmm. Foucault's Pendulum. This is practically a manual on government conspiracies. And... Uh, Let's see, Adrift in the Telluric Currents. Now, this is a little tougher read, but, but uh, it's good. It's really good. And a, a, a must read is the fifth column, okay, by, by Richard Eco. Now, this man, he was a prophet. I mean, he proved without reasonable doubt that we've been living amongst aliens for generations, and the government knows everything. I mean, it, it even hints that one of our presidents was a was a alien I'll if not it. at least happy and I, I i i won't uh tell you which president i want to ruin the surprise for you <laughs> uh anyway it's it's all in there crop circles abductions etc cetera, etc cetera. <laughs> look if you want my advice don't trust anybody okay i mean i can sense you're on the level here but most of the time people you just don't know i mean aliens are everywhere man Hey, Archie, how do you know I'm not an alien? <laughs> Murph, you're so silly. Everyone knows aliens deny their own existence. Well, I appreciate you letting me borrow these. Sure, just take them home with you. Uh, could I ask you a few more questions? Sure, that would be great. Okay, before we get into this, I'm going to end the episode here, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you're enjoying my let's play of Tex Murphy Pandora Directive. Uh, do let me know as usual. Like, comment, subscribe, check out my other videos, you know, all that fun pizzazz. Uh, with that, you guys have a good day, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye!